Stay tuned because Good Sports is coming up next. Kansas City Sports and Fitness is the magazine for sports fans in KC. Inside, we cover local sports and local teams from pro to peewee and everything in between. And this month's free copy of Kansas City Sports and Fitness includes the KC Baseball Report presented by Budweiser. You'll find Kansas City Sports and Fitness all over KC at places like the Overland Park Golf Club. And it's free, so pick one up today. This show was recorded live on Saturday, July 21st. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Welcome to Good Sports, the Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Show. Now, this segment is presented by Kansas City Chiropractic. Kansas City Chiropractic understands the high-pressure demands placed upon individuals in the workplace and the athletic demands people place on their bodies. They offer the care that can relieve pain and stress and improve overall health. You can call them at 816-753-4600 or visit KansasCityChiropractic.com. Hello, everyone. I am Steve Fish. I'm the publisher of Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Magazines. And you're watching or listening to Good Sports, the Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Show. Now, this show is being taped at Old Shawnee Pizza, which is located at 61st and Neiman, a half mile north of Shawnee Mission Parkway, where you can get two free classic salads with the purchase of a large or a biggin' pizza. Visit their two locations, a 61st and Neiman in Shawnee, where we're doing our show today, and 34th and Gibbs in Kansas City, Kansas. You can call in your order here at 913-631-5716 or at their other location at 913-677-1844, or you can visit their website, shawneepizza.com. Now, today we're taping our radio show, which will be on ESPN 1510 Saturdays at 8 a.m., and our TV show, which can be seen on Sure West Cable on Channel 7 at 8.30 a.m. at 4.30 p.m. and at 8.30 p.m. every single day. And now you can also view our show and some of our past shows on YouTube. All you have to do is search for the Good Sports KC channel, and that's all one word, Good Sports KC. Now, before we get started with the show, I want to tell everyone that the current issue of Kansas City Sports and Fitness is available free at over 700 locations in KC. And this month, with our July issue, KC Sports continues to celebrate our 15th year as the magazine for sports fans in KC. And our new issue of She KC is now available at over 500 locations. Now, in our current issue of KC Sports, we feature our KC Baseball Spotlight, which is presented by Budweiser. And this month, we visit with some of the All-Stars in our city, the Royals' most recent All-Star, Billy Butler, and two-time All-Star and the member of the 1985 Royals, Danny Jackson. And in She KC, we have a story on Kansas City's own gold medal winner, Christy Ambrosi, who was a part of the U.S. Olympic softball team in 2000. Plus, we show you ways uh, you can have a safe summer and protect yourself this summer. Now, you can pick up your copy of our current issue of KC Sports at Burger King's around the city, both Minsky's on Berry Road, Mr. Goodsense, the Kansas City Ice Center, uh, here at Old Shawnee Pizza where we're doing our show, and Dick's Sporting Goods in the KC metro area. And for a complete list of locations where you can find KC Sports, visit our website, kcsportspaper.com. You'll find a link to a list of locations right on the front page of our website. And you can actually check out a PDF of our current issue and many of our other issues as well on our website, kcsportspaper.com. And our publication, She KC, is now out and available at many of the locations where you can find KC Sports and Fitness. Plus, you can visit our website, shekc.com. Check us out on Facebook by searching shekc, all one word, or follow us on Twitter at she underscore kc. Now, our first guest uh, who's joining us is a regular on our show. He's with us uh, pretty much once every month, uh, Greg Pryor from the 1985 world champion KC Royals, and he brought an extra special guest with him today, Michelle Pryor, who is Greg's wife and a partner in their business, Life Priority. Welcome to the show. Thank you, Steve. Great to be here again, Steve. Now, uh, Greg is a regular con contributor to KC Sports, and he provides us with information on nutritional supplements uh, that can help each of us. Uh, today, we're going to discuss some healthy solutions that we all can use with Greg and Michelle. But first, I want to turn and talk to Greg about some baseball stuff. Um, it's 150 degrees outside right now. Uh, it's been ridiculously hot for a couple of weeks. You know, I know there are a lot of people that have jobs 
out in this heat, uh, you know, us regular people that have jobs out in this heat, landscapers and construction people and people that work on the roads and things like that. But baseball players also have to deal with this. And sometimes on the field, it's even hotter than it is for those of us up in the stands. Um, you know, baseball players and even soccer players and football players all have to play in, in super hot conditions. Um, uh, did you have to have a spell like this during your pro career that you can remember? And how did you deal with something like that? Well, luckily, my parents uh, had our family uh, in, in Florida when I was in high school and college. So I, had, I was used to uh, the heat in the summers, right. being from Florida, and the humidity. But uh, trying to perform in front of uh, ten to 40,000 people uh, on a consistent basis is not easy. What I was really concerned about was the fans in the stands that would sit if it was 100 degrees and they were sitting and watch us do it. I was wondering, mm -hmm. you know, what, what was going on in their brain. Because <laughs> we when we were in the dugout, we would look across the field and uh, on AstroTurf where I used to play on, and you could see the waves of heat uh, yeah. coming up. And yeah. you tried not to look at it because it made it hotter. Right. But, but between <laughs> innings, Steve, I used to come in and uh, stand in ice they had ice buckets or trough oh, really? of ice, and, and I would come in and stand right in the ice with my shoes on. Uh, really? During the inning, yeah. And, you know, it wouldn't uh, get my feet that wet because it would evaporate very quickly. But uh, yeah, my, sure. my feet were so hot that uh, it really cooled well, it off. Well, you're sweating anyway. It made it yeah. tolerable. So we, we did get a break. It wasn't like a, somebody that's working an 8-to-5 job out um, laying brick. Uh, that can't get any relief. but uh, And even in golf, some people say they don't want to play courses where there's no shade. So the mm -hmm. heat is a factor, but it's the same for everybody. So um, the Major League dugouts, are they air-conditioned? Are they heated? Uh, when I was with the White Sox in Old Comiskey Park, no, we didn't have much okay. heat or air conditioning. In fact, uh, uh, the the cold is what, it, what really bothered me when I played ball. I, I didn't like anything under 40 degrees. And I, uh, when I played in Chicago, I would go up into the clubhouse and put my glove on the uh, heater during right. during the inning, and then right. and then when Harry Carey would call the third out, <laughs> I'd run back straight back on the field from the clubhouse. <laughs> that's that's funny, uh, but I yeah I certainly understand that. Um, you know I just thought well I know Starlight is air conditioned on the stage, and I figured well the pro ba the pro teams probably now have that in the dugout something going blowers or something yeah. like that going and stuff like that. Now last week was a big week here in Kansas City, although the All Star Game activities seemed like a long time ago. Already, um, you met up with some players from the years that you played in the major leagues. Who did you who did you run into? You had some general managers that you met. Well, uh, one that was uh, very special to my heart was Roland Heeman, who was the general manager of the White Sox when I got my first uh, break in the big leagues. Mm -hmm. uh, he was general manager for, for Bill Veck in Chicago with the White Sox, and he uh, and my agent we signed a contract there, and I played there four years. And then um, I, I saw John Scherholtz mm -hmm. uh, also, and he, he hired me in 82 to come to Kansas City, and then he fired me in 86. So I got to see two general managers. Uh, <laughs> nice guy. Yeah. <laughs> now, see, that, and I think that that's the – this is a joke, but I think that that's the big problem with the Royals is at least with Scherholtz, his first name was John. It's the first name of the general manager. His first name was John, and he had a winning team. Since then, we've had an Allard – We've had a Herc, and we've had a Dayton. What the heck names are those? You know, we, we need a Bill or something like that in there that's going to make these decisions for the team. I, I think that's a part of the problem with the team is, as well. Well, I'll be a Rolls fan forever, you know. <laughs> it's a soft spot in my heart. And, uh, of course. Hopefully we get Rudolph in here to get the job done. <laughs> Rudolph? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you also ran into, uh, you, gave me, you sent me a note, a text, Gaylord Perry. Did you run into him? Yeah, Gaylord, they brought a lot of Hall of Famers to sign autographs. He was one that was here and uh, had played with him in 76 with the Rangers when we were both there. I was uh, kind of fearful of him back then because he was a bona fide Cy Young winner in both leagues. Right. And then he got traded to the Royals uh, in 82 mm -hmm. and, uh, in fact, pitched a p complete game at age 44 for the Ooh. Royals in Texas against his old team. Wow. So I went over and gave him a big hug, had pictures taken with him, and um, – Ask him, you know, we we talked about the pine tar game, because he uh, he stole the pine tar bat uh, during the pine tar game oh, really? in New York and got thrown out of the game. Oh, and it uh, they fined him two hundred fifty dollars, and uh, he told me that uh, somebody on our team told him that they were going to pay his fine. And I won't say who it is, <laughs> but uh, he hasn't got his fine. He, he said, "I never nobody paid my fine. I paid." But if it he myself. has the pi if he has the pine tar bat, it was the best two hundred fifty dollars no. he had to pay. I think, didn't it? I think <laughs> the pine tar bat might be uh, in the hall of. I think it's in the Hall of Fame, Fame or yeah. something like that. Um, what was it like? Did you ever face him as a hitter? Uh, I think I did. I, I, I'd have to look so back you at don't, the stats. So you don't remember the knuckleball or anything well, like that? Well, you know, he, he had a knack for making the ball sink, and uh, people thought there was a lot of uh, 
liquid on stuff it. Stuff on it, yeah. But uh, they never caught him, so he's... They caught his brother, though. He's didn't innocent. They? <laughs> didn't, they fill, didn't they catch Phil with a file, uh, a nail file or something? Jim like Perry? That? No, that was a Necro. Phil Necro. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. I'm thinking, of, that's yeah, okay. I'm thinking about those guys. Yeah, that's right. You're right. Um, Mini Minoso? Yeah, Mini uh, was great. In fact, I get this ball. Uh, you'll uh, show the, f- the people on TV here, the, uh, the all-star baseball here, and uh, Mini Minoso... Uh, signed it for me right on the sweet spot. Uh, Mini Minoso got to the big leagues in 1949 mm-hmm. uh, from Cuba. Mm-hmm. He played in the 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s. And in 1980, uh, Tony La Russa, uh, at a fi- as a 50-year-old, pinched hit Mini Minoso for me uh, with the White Sox. And um, I thought it was a little bit more of a gimmick than I was wanting because I wanted to win the game. Yeah. <laughs> And so I told LaRusa that, and I think that's part of why I got traded to Kansas City. Oh. <laughs> I expressed displeasure. <laughs> Nothing against many, but it was just kind of a gimmick in a major league game. Well, well let's, let's turn to uh, your article that's in, in this month's issue. We'll come back to some baseball if we get a, a, get a chance. Um, in your article, you say there are all sorts of health claims out there and solutions to make us feel better. Um, but you say, how do you tell fact from fiction? And, um, you know, of course, eating right is one of those solutions. Um, and, of course, we all should eat right. But, you know, that's, that's one of the luxuries out there is we can, we can indulge in other things as well. But even the perfect diet can't always deliver the nutrition that we need. Um, you know, you, you what know, are your thoughts? Well, Steve, right before we came on the show here, uh, Michelle and I, uh, who's here with me, she'll, you'll mm-hmm. see her in a second. We uh, looked at a videotape of uh, Dirk and Sandy. Uh, Dirk Pearson, Sandy Shaw, who wrote this book. Uh, we looked at a videotape uh, coming here, and, and it really impressed upon me that uh, people need to be aware that the oxidants are attacking us from the outside in the environment that we're in, and also they attack us from the inside. Right. And, and it's a constant. It's never going to stop. So if people in our industry, what we t- teach people is to how to put the right antioxidants in so that the body can defend itself against the oxidants. It's almost like rust. In, in, we're, mm-hmm. we're rusting on the outside, but more importantly, we're rusting on the inside. Most people don't do anything until they have a problem. Right. So what we try to teach people is to understand what the processes are so they can de- defend themselves. And, yeah, in some of these products, I mean, we're going to talk about products that will help with your mind and product th- products that will help with general overall nutrition and then also a product that helps with your joints and things like that. One of those products is Lift. Michelle, can you fill us in on, on Lift and what Lift does for people? Um, Lift is actually my very favorite product. Um, at one point in my life, I was drinking 8 to 10 Coca-Colas a day. I had no energy. I didn't feel good. I had three small children. You know, Greg was on the road. Um, I had a lot of responsibility, and I felt that that caffeine really uh, is what I needed. Mm -hmm. Um, Greg had put some of the lift out on the cabinet for me to take, and I was extremely skeptical. But once I started using that, I couldn't believe how much better I felt. Mm -hmm. And I literally got anywhere from five to six hours worth of productive time. I could communicate better. And um, one of the things that for me has been exciting is I've been in two severe auto accidents. So I've had two major brain injuries. And I have to be careful with things that I use because they affect me a lot differently than other people. Mm -hmm. And Lyft is phenomenal. Mm -hmm. Um, It just gives me good energy. It comes in um, both the powder and it comes in a capsule form. So um, whichever way you want to take it, I mean, it is bona fide and that product uh, was actually created way back in the 70s and has been used regularly by the scientist who created it since that period of time. So how does a product like Lyft compare to, uh, you know, these energy drinks that are so popular these days? I mean, it, it seems to do the same kind of thing. You'd mentioned, you know, give you four or five hours of energy. It seems to do the same thing. But what's, is there a difference between them? I mean, I know price-wise, this is a lot less expensive when you when you break it down than those five-hour energies that you buy at um you know at the quick trips or things like that is there a difference between what it is that they do and the chemicals that are in or or the you know the the you know nutritional stuff that's in those oh absolutely um lift has a really good combination of nutrients b6 b12 Mm -hmm. l-phena aniline And when Dirk created this product from a chemical standpoint, he knew what uh, nutrients needed to be in the brain to be able to help help it uh, with uh, memory, focus, concentration. 
there is 80 milligrams of caffeine within this mm -hmm. and it's it's pharmaceutical grade and it's helped uh, the nutrients pass uh, to the brain so that it can be taken. A lot of the energy drinks that are out there today, they have high amounts of caffeine to them or a form of caffeine, whether it's guarana, go to cola. Um, and those are the things that when people take too many of these drinks or even one, they're creating situations where people may have adrenal fatigue. Mm. And, you know, I've used Lyft for almost 20 years now. Mm. I use it every single morning, first thing in the morning. It puts me in a good mood. I make it in my orange juice. I even sneak it in different people's drinks that I think need to have is better that it, Is that it right over there? This is it. <laughs> and I love it. I mean, it has, it's been a godsend for me. Right, right. Now, you also have a product. Uh, that delivers the right amount of nutrients and helps support the immune system and it's a multivitamin. Greg, what product is that? Well, that's our one per meal lifeguard. Uh, okay. That's this uh, product. It was created uh, by Dirk Pierce and Sandy Shaw again, mm -hmm. uh, and it's uh, unique in that uh, Dirk and Sandy recommend that people take uh, one with each meal, where most people have been taught if they do take supplements, and hopefully everybody is using some sort of supplementation, uh, to take uh, supplements once a day, but our bodies are 24 hours a day. Well, it doesn't stop, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. at different times we need different things. And vitamin C, uh, we need to replenish the vitamin C in our bodies every four, four to six to eight hours, mm -hmm. depending upon our usage in our food. So they created this uh, one per meal lifeguard that has above the uh, uh, RDAs of many of the nutrients that uh, people should be, be getting in, and some are the same as the, the RDAs, but it gives you a, a more of a chance to get more of the RDAs uh, because uh, we think that people need more, and Dirk and Sandy's created a formula called One Per Meal that uh, provide that for people. And it uh, helps to, I mean, you, with that rusting thing that you mentioned earlier on, there's these three free radicals mm -hmm. in our body. I don't know exactly what they do or anything like that, but it helps to... Uh, fend off the free radicals, which keeps, you know, b b explain that. Well, you know, it, it, as an example, when people exercise, their bodies uh, release uh, free radicals inside the body. And, and I recommend uh, anybody that's exercising to take uh, antioxidants prior to exercise mm -hmm. so that the body has the necessary antioxidants to defend the oxidants that are being released. Gotcha. So it's uh, it's 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 an anti-rust product, I guess is a good way to put it, Steve, <laughs> <laughs> for, for the inside of the body. <laughs> there we go. Well, you know, and and the, there's, it's got a great uh, a B vitamin uh, formula in it. You know, there's most of the B vitamins are in it. So, and people, a lot of people are taking a B12 as a single product, but mm -hmm. we, we don't sell too many single ingredient uh, products uh, in our company. Right. A couple, but uh, we we love these formulas because they were uh, created by people that know what they're talking about. Right. And the B vitamin, it converts food to energy. Is that well? Is that part of what it does? It, the B vitamins is probably known as the stress vitamins you know when you're under a lot of stress your body uses up a lot of bees and you should replenish those and the easy way to do it and the the inexpensive way to do it uh, is to use uh, a, a multiple vitamin that in a capsule form which is what we we, we uh, support that provides the amount of nutrients that you're mm -hmm. not getting in your food right right now okay so we've talked about how to brighten your mind and we've talked about how to uh, keep your body healthier and stronger uh, now uh, be we're active more mentally and we're, we're better off a little bit physically, but um, as we age, those joints kind of bother us as well. And a lot of us, uh, you know, might pop the Advil or something like that, but that's not really the best solution for that. And you've got another product that really helps with the joint issues that we face as we age and, and as, you know, we're, we're a little less active, but it's harder to, you know, it's harder to get up the stairs. It's harder to, you know, lift yourself out of the chair and things like that. What, tell us about that. Well, part. I had a problem uh, in 1996. I couldn't bend the middle finger of my right hand. It, uh, I was trying to play golf and it That's hurt too much. Hand, too. Uh, it was my golf hand. At okay. That time. <laughs> okay. And a friend told me about uh, glucosamine. It wasn't even on the market yet. It wasn't in any drug stores or, right. or Costco or anywhere. And I started using it. Uh, he had some that he uh, let me use, and I started using it. And the first week, it didn't work. Second week, didn't work. Third week, finally, I had more flexibility. Mm -hmm. The fourth week, I told Michelle, I said, look, we, we need to sell this. Now, now, simply, for all the people that are listening, uh, glucose means in everybody's body that's listening uh, or watching this on TV, it, it comes from our food. 
it, it's essential for cartilage to stay healthy. If without a, an adequate supply from our food, our cartilage starts wearing over time. Right. When you take a capsule, the body recognizes it as being from food. It's the same molecule. And when it gets in a synovial fluid around the cartilage, the cartilage says thank you very much, and it uses it to, to hopefully get rid of the symptoms and right. to make the cartilage healthy again. We, we can't make cartilage reappear once it's disappeared, but it can, I, I hate to say the word heal because the FDA might be watching, right. but the cartilage can do wonderful things if it has enough gl uh, glucosamine in the synovial fluid. Right, well we've only got a, a, a couple of minutes here left, but I want to mention that we have a special offer for our viewers and our listeners, that if you go to your website, and the website is lifepriority.com, uh, and when you place your order for any of these products or any of the other Life Priority products that, are, uh, that they carry at their webs on their website, and you put in the word LIFEP, L-I-F-E-P, you can get free shipping uh, with those products. And um, tell, tell us, uh, give us a brief rundown of some of the other products that you have. Michelle. Ahead, Michelle. Let Michelle. Well, two of the ones that I'm real partial to is I love the lift because I love the energy that it mm -hmm. gives me. And then uh, one of the other products is called Mind. Um, <coughs> It's just a great product that has choline to it, which helps the brain be able to focus and concentrate. Uh, we have another product called Muscle Memory, which does have um, arginine to it and choline. It's really good for exercise. Uh, arginine has come out in a lot of recent studies, mm -hmm. it being very important for the heart because of uh, its relationship with nitric oxide. Um, and then uh, another product that I take for my memory is called phosphatidylserine. We have a vitamin C. We have a calcium product that has three forms of calcium, which is great. The body uptakes calcium in different ways. Um, we're just pleased with everything we have, and we use them every single day ourselves personally. Right, I was going to say, and you guys, you guys have used them for many, Since many years. Since 1994. And you have a number of people that have been using them for a long period of time as well. We've got a great customer base. Uh, we're, Greg and I are very passionate, and we just love people, uh, people and helping them find the benefit. Neither Greg or I take any medications. Mm -hmm. We're not on any medication at mm -hmm. this point. So Any prescriptions. No, right. we focused on trying to do the best that we can to, as a preventative, and I think we've done fairly well. Absolutely, absolutely. And again, uh, special offer for free shipping. Uh, go to lifepriority.com and type in L-I-F-E-P, Life P, when you check out. Um, we're going to take a, a quick break. You're watching or listening. First of all, thank you very much, Michelle and Greg thank Pryor you. Here, Steve. from Life Priority. Thank you so much. We're going to take that break. You're watching or listening to Good Sports, the KC Sports and Fitness and She KC Magazine show. We're coming to you from Old Shawnee Pizza, which is located at 61st and Neiman, a half mile north of Shawnee Mission Parkway. I'm Steve Fish. We'll be right back. The sports stars are out in this month's Kansas City Sports and Fitness Magazine All-Star Game issue. Check out our exclusive Budweiser All-Star Game Baseball Report, plus the Great Life Golf and Fitness Report, and the Surplus Exchange KC Football Report. You'll find Kansas City Sports and Fitness Magazine all over KC. And it's always free, so pick one up today. And be sure to check out Good Sports, the KC Sports and Fitness TV show. You'll find it on YouTube by searching for the Good Sports KC channel. Are you tired of paying $40, $50, or even $60 to play golf? Great Life Golf and Fitness at River Oaks is changing the game by offering a $29.99 family membership that includes unlimited green fees, a fitness center, and access to Great Life's 16 other locations. And check out all the great weekly specials at River Oaks, including All You Can Play Wednesday, Dollar Beer Fridays, and the Everyday Senior Special. For more information, call River Oaks at 816-966-8111 or visit greatlifegolf.com. These days, we're all so busy, and many of us ignore our health and let stress turn into chronic pain. Dr. Lynn McIntosh of Kansas City Chiropractic can provide you with the proper care to relieve pain and stress, improve your health, and get more out of life. And right now, like Kansas City Chiropractic on Facebook and save 50% on a 30-minute massage. To make an appointment with Dr. McIntosh, call 816-753-4600. Most insurance plans are welcome. For more information on Dr. McIntosh and Kansas City Chiropractic, go online at kansascitychiropractic.com. I'm Cheryl Burke, two-time champion of Dancing with the Stars, and Jazzercise is my kind of fitness. It's the only place I can dance to Justin, Beyonce, and Pink and get a total body workout in 60 minutes. Visit Stanley Fitness Center at 151st and Lowell or call 913-486-8722. 
With the current trend to live a greener lifestyle, many people and businesses now recycle their electronics. At the Surplus Exchange, your e-waste will never go to a landfill or incinerator, nor will we allow e-waste to be shipped overseas. Some companies employ this tactic and end up polluting other countries with our waste. All materials are safely tracked, destroyed, or reclaimed right here in the U.S. The Surplus Exchange is Kansas City's link between industry, charity, and the environment. To find out more, visit surplusexchange.org. Whether you're playing a sport, running a business, or learning how to use an iPad, your ability to make split-second decisions is essential for your success. Hey sports fans, this is Greg Pryor. I was an infielder in Major League Baseball for over nine seasons and was a member of the 85 World Champion Royals. My decisions in the field and at the plate could have been the difference between winning and losing. Since 1994, I have owned a local health supplement company called Life Priority. Life Priority offers many nutritional formulas that give your body the nutrients that can help your brain keep pace in today's fast lifestyle. To see all 17 Life Priority products, please visit my website at lifepriority.com or call me at 913-438-5433. Use Life Priority products and improve your chances of winning. For free shipping, use promo code LIFEP at lifepriority.com or call me today at 913-438-5433. Four three eight five four three three. Two of the finest golf clubs in Kansas City are right in Overland Park. St. Andrews Golf Club at Neiman and 135th Street and Overland Park Golf Club at 125th and Quivera. For tee times, call St. Andrews at 913-897-3804 and OP Golf Club at 913-897-3809 or visit golfop.com. At Stanley Tire and Auto, you can get an oil change for $22.99, a wheel alignment for $69.99, and seniors can get a 10% discount on their purchase with your coupon from KC Sports and Fitness. Visit Stanley Tire and Auto, located two blocks east of Metcalf off 151st Street or call 913-239-8473. If you're buying or selling a home, contact Shannon Dozer's Keller Williams Real Estate Office. The Shannon Dozer Real Estate Group delivers a personal touch, professional approach, and positive results for every customer. Call Shannon at 913-488-9126 or visit shannondozer.com. We are back. You're watching and listening to Good Sports, the Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Show, the show that complements Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Magazines. I am Steve Fish, and today we're coming to you from Old Shawnee Pizza, located at 61st and Neiman, a half mile north of Shawnee Mission Parkway, where you can get two free classic salads with the purchase of a large or a biggin pizza. Uh, you can visit their two locations, 61st and Neiman in Shawnee, where we are today, and 34th and Gibbs in Kansas City, Kansas. You can call in your order here at 913-631-5716 or at their other location at, six seven, uh, at 913-677-1844. You can also visit ShawneePizza.com. Now, this segment of Good Sports is brought to you by the First Student Charter Bus Rental Company. Uh, those yellow buses that you see that transport your kids can also be rented for group activities like taking a group to the big game, corporate events, church or youth group trips, special events, shuttles, and more. The next time you're planning a group outing, choose yellow and choose first. You can call 866-514-8747 for details or you can visit their website firstcharterbus.com. Now, in our current issue of Kansas City Sports and Fitness, check out the Surplus Exchange Football Report. This month, we analyze a story that appeared on the Sports Illustrated website saying that the Chiefs have all the talent in place to be Super Bowl contenders this season. And in SheKC, we feature a story on swimming training and how to avoid shoulder injuries. And uh, Dr. McIntosh, who wrote that, will be joining us in our next segment. Plus, we feature a story on the Women's Foundation of Greater Kansas City. You can pick up your copy of Kansas City Sports and Fitness at over 700 locations, including the Kansas City Ice Center and Mafia Mike's Pizza on 87th and Lackman and Lenexa and Mafia Pizzeria Southside at 127th and Metcalf. Uh, you also find SheKC at over 500 locations, and you can find those locations on our website, SheKC.com. If you'd like to follow us on Facebook or Twitter, you can go to our websites and follow the links to our pages. Our websites are KCSportsPaper.com and SheKC.com. And now you can also view our show and some of our past shows on YouTube. And all you have to do is search for the Good Sports KC channel. And that's all one word, Good Sports KC. 
And now we'd like to welcome some new advertisers to Kansas City Sports and Fitness, and they include the UPS stores located at 103rd and Warnell and 121st and State Line in Leewood, faxing, scanning, notary services. Uh, the two South KC UPS stores offer services that can make life easier and help businesses run more smoothly. The Bogey Beaters Golf Classic, which is coming up on September 8th at Hodge Park. You can play golf with former Royals Greg Pryor, who was just here with us, Danny Jackson, Al Fitzmorris, and former Chief Walter White. Now, this tournament benefits Autism Speaks and the Liberty Hospital Foundation. Now, there is an entry form for the tournament in this month's Kansas City Sports and Fitness, and you can also visit the Hands on Golf Facebook page for more details. And Staley Farms Great Life Golf Club, where you can sign up now as a member of this elite golf club and save big. For more information, call 816 595 7301 or visit staleyfarms.com. Plus, we want to mention several advertisers in She KC. They are Kansas City Chiropractic, Safe Kansas, Family Bicycles, Superior Toyota, Your Wellness Connection, Polofsky and Associates, Sport Court. Stanley Jazzercise, Garden of Delights Yoga, Beans and Greens, I-9 Sports, and Shannon Dozer's Keller Williams Real Estate Office. Now we're going to take another quick break, and when we come back, we'll talk with Dr. Lynn McIntosh from Kansas City Chiropractic. We're coming to you from uh, Old Shawnee Pizza, located on 61st and Neiman, just a half mile north of Shawnee Mission Parkway. Uh, I'm Steve Fish. We'll be right back. There's family fun for everyone at Danny Jackson's Incredible. Bowling, mini golf, laser tag, and more. Incredible has it all. And right now with the coupon in KC Sports and Fitness, you can buy one double play and get one free. Or buy one meal at Incredible's Breakfast Nook and get one free. Visit Incredible at 151st and Antioch. Find them online at Incredible.com or call 913-851-1700. After a million dollar renovation, the Kansas City Ice Center is now enrolling for Learn to Skate and Learn to Play Hockey classes. The KC Ice Center is located two miles west of 435 on Johnson Drive. Come on out and check out a public skating session or call them to schedule a party or group rental. For more information or to register for a class, visit KCIceCenter.com or call 913-441-3033. That's 913-441-3033. For over 40 years, Old Shawnee Pizza has been serving up great pizza and Italian food in Kansas City. Call 913-631-5716 for Old Shawnee Pizza at 61st and Neiman, and 913-677-1844 for their new location at 2422 South 34th Street. There's still time to sign up for the Junior Golf Camp, Get Golf Ready Clinic, and the Family Golf Event featuring clinics and contests at Heart of America Golf Academy. Visit hoagolfacademy.com or call 816-513-8940 for details. Your center for natural healing is the Gardens of Delight. Yoga, Tai Chi, natural wellness therapy in a serene setting near downtown Parkville. Visit gardensofdelight.org or call 816-584-0777 for more information or to sign up for a yoga class. The goal of the Beans and Greens program is to encourage shoppers utilizing the Beans and Greens Match program to enhance their diets with local produce by making healthy local produce more accessible and affordable. For more information, visit beansandgreens.org. Donations are welcome. Get two large one-topping pizzas for just $14.99 at Mafia Mike's Pizza, 15205 87th and Lenexa, or Mafia Pizzeria Southside at 12627 Metcalf in Overland Park with your coupon from Kansas City Sports. Great pizza and a great offer you can't refuse. Call Mafia Mike's at 913-660-1441 and Mafia Pizzeria at 913-322-6666. 
Eagles Landing Golf Course is the place to play golf in the Southland and is by far the best golf value around. Visit EaglesLandingGolfCourse.com. And for tee times, call 816-318-0004 and make the drive to see why Eagles Landing is the best golf value in KC. Sign up now for the fall programs presented by I-9 Sports. Flag football, soccer, cheerleading, basketball, and baseball for boys and girls 2 to 14. All skills are welcome and there are no tryouts. Call 913-904-0810 or visit I-9Sports.com. Great golf, great fitness, and great prices. You'll find that combination at five KC area Great Life Golf Courses. Get unlimited green fees, seven-day advanced tee times, access to a full fitness center, and to 16 area golf courses. Visit greatlifegolf.com for more details on the $29.99 per month single or family membership at River Oaks and Grandview, the Oaks and Leavenworth, and courses in DeSoto and Ottawa. And find out more about the $49.99 membership at the Leavenworth Country Club. For great golf, great fitness, and great prices, visit greatlifegolf.com. We are back. Uh, welcome back to Good Sports, Kansas City Sports and Fitness, and SheKC Show, the show that complements Kansas City Sports and Fitness and SheKC Magazines. I am Steve Fish. Today we're coming to you from Old Shawnee Pizza, located at 61st and Neiman, a half mile north of Shawnee Mission Parkway, where you can get two free classic salads with the purchase of a large or a biggin pizza. Visit their two locations, 61st and Neiman, where we're doing our show today, and 34th and Gibbs in Kansas City, Kansas. You can call in your order here. Here at 913-631-5716 or at their other location at 913-677-1844. Now you can also visit their website, shawneepizza.com. Now this segment of Good Sports is brought to you by the Surplus Exchange where you can outfit your office for under $500, including a computer, executive chairs, desks, flat screen monitors, office supplies, and of course all sorts of different computers you can choose from. You'll find them all at discounted prices at the Surplus Exchange. You can visit their website at surplusexchange.org. You can call them at 816-472-0444 for more information as well. Now I also want to mention that some, uh, some of the experts who each will be a part of our show during the month, they are Dr. Lynn McIntosh, who will be joining us in just a second from Kansas City Chiropractic off the plaza. Former Royal World Series champ Greg Pryor from Life Priority Nutrition, who will share nutritional supplement information with us like he did in our first segment. We've got a double header here with, these, with our two guests today. And nationally known safety expert Marty Augustine from Safe Kansas. Each will join us on the air once a month to talk about things like exercise, health solutions, sports, and more. And you can read a health or a sports tip from each in our current issue of KC Sports and Fitness or SheKC. Now to read each of their current articles, pick up your copy of KC Sports and Fitness at over 700 locations, including the Burger Kings around Kansas City and the Sport Clips around Kansas City also. Or you can also find SheKC at over 500 locations around the city. Now in this month's SheKC, we introduce you to a female police officer whose job is to serve the city on horseback as a part of the Mounted Patrol. We also talk with a former pro golfer, Liz Smart Hinton, who now teaches golf at the Overland Park Golf Course. Plus, in KC Sports, we feature our golf report presented by Great Life Golf and Fitness. We've got stories on the Overland Park Golf Course uh, and also why you should watch out for off-the-rack clubs. I also want to mention that on July 28th, we will be at former Royal Danny Jackson's Incredible, which is located at 151st in Antioch, and our taping will start at about 1 o'clock that day. On August 4th, we'll be back here at Old Shawnee Pizza, located a half mile north of Shawnee Mission Parkway on Neiman Road, and our taping will start at about 12.30 that day. Then coming up on Friday, August 10th, uh, we've got a special Friday show. We'll be at the Kansas City Ice Center recording an upcoming show. Uh, Casey Ice Center is located two miles west of 435 on Johnson Drive, and our taping, we don't know exactly what time. I think it'll be a little later in the afternoon. We'll let you know on that. And then on an upcoming Saturday in August, we will be at a new location, the Overland Park Golf Club, at 125th and Quivira, and we've got more details to come on that taping as well. Now, as I mentioned, we are joined by a regular guest on our show, Dr. Lynn McIntosh. She is a board-certified chiropractor licensed in Kansas and Missouri. And in addition to being licensed to provide general chiropractic care, Dr. McIntosh is a certified chiropractic sports physician. She works with athletes from multiple disciplines on specific sports-related problems. Welcome to the show, Dr. McIntosh. Thanks, Steve. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. Now, Dr. McIntosh is writing about something most of us do for about 
two seconds before we begin our sports workout, and that is to stretch. Most of, I mean, you know, a, a, a pro athlete, somebody that, that is inv- really involved in a sport might do that, uh, and they might have a stretching regime that they go through. But, uh, you know, I, and, and I remember us going through a little bit of stretching when, you know, when I was a little kid in the gym class, and sure, we, we wore the Chuck Taylor Converse or the Keds, yes. and that's all. Those were the only <laughs> athletic shoes that you had available uh-huh. at that time. But weekend warriors, it's like, let me get out on the course or get out on the field, and the heck with all this other stuff. But stretching is really, really, really important. Well, the actual, the interesting part about this is that some of the new research I- has decided that basically we don't understand stretching very well, and. Whereas we have considered it as a prevention for injuries and all that kind of stuff. Um, Yes and no, depending on your sport. Um, For strength exercise, the new, you know, first, the first one came out in 2005 that kind of upset the apple cart because everyone was like, oh, of course, stretching, you need to lengthen the muscles so you prevent injury. Well, uh, this was the beginning of starting to go, maybe not. Maybe for strength exercises, if you overstretch pri- just prior, mm-hmm. immediately before, maybe this reduces strength. Mm. And so now they... By strength exercises, you mean like weightlifting? And yeah, if you're going to power lift, if you're going to clean and jerk, if you're going to do this kind of stuff. Um, it's something where it is it is a strength period. Right. Not a, now we're not talking about gymnastics. We're not talking about something where the advantage of flexibility participates in the sport. I see. But so this is a big thing. And then Runner's Magazine picked up and said, oh, same number of injuries, whether you stretch or whether you don't stretch Mm. and that kind of thing. So, and then, but that was kind of isolated. And so now it's, it's changed in that we think it's a great idea, especially afterwards. And you should, but you should not stretch a cold muscle. Is the new theory? Really? Of, uh, whereas before, it's like, oh, stretch so that you warm the muscle up. <clears throat> so now it's kind of weird. You're supposed to do some calisthenics or jog lightly or do something before you stretch because you don't want to stretch it cold. And that works for a couple different reasons. There is the muscle spindle in the muscle and the Golgi tendon organ in the uh, tendon, and that each regulates how far the muscle wants to let it go when you're Mm -hmm. stretching. Mm -hmm. And so uh, two things that have been interesting in in this is that they kind of look at it like it anesthetizes the muscle a little bit. So one, you don't want that because you don't, you want to feel if there is an injury happening. So a stretching can numb it? Kind of? A little. You you don't feel as much? It has some anesthetic effect. Okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, not to the point where I wouldn't call it numb, right? But it is, it is. If it's numb and tingling and yeah. all that stuff, <laughs> that's then, a then different you got, you problem. Got, yeah. That's totally not stretching. <laughs> um, but they're finding that a lot of the injuries happen in normal range of motion. Well, if it happens mm-hmm. in normal range, then stretching would not have helped because it would be if it was end range, like if it was too short, then it wouldn't have helped. Now they still think that uh, extra. Uh, stretching after an exercise as a cool down right. is good to warm you up to get you back to normal for the next uh, time. And that it's not that stretching, but at least it's just not immediately before. So at least 15 minutes. Okay. And that it's best to warm the muscle up by doing an over exaggerated motion of what you are going to be doing. I see. So if you're going to be jogging, then you should do. You know, something that looks like a lunge, but it's like an overstretched muscle, over, you know, done where you're really striding out. You go down into, you know, kind of a stretch mm-hmm. bend, but in mm-hmm. the direction of what you're going to be doing anyway. Uh, after you have done some light jogging or calisthenics or something to warm that up a little bit. So Is that why you see some athletes, and we might see that in the Olympics that are coming yes. up, where they'll do, the, they'll do that, but they'll also do something where their knees come up even higher yes. as well. It's, an, uh, it's, it's ballistic versus static stretching. Strat- static stretching is the, I'm sitting down, you know, you've got your legs spread, mm-hmm. you're doing this, and you're holding this for this long, you know, and it kind of hurts, and it kind of gets, and then it doesn't hurt as much, so that's kind of that mm-hmm. anesthetic effect. Mm-hmm. And then... In, on, really, on a muscle fiber standpoint, um, they think if you do this too often that it, or too too far, 
that you can do some sort of muscle damage. Now, mm -hmm. if you do that and then you, so you've just done some minor damage to this muscle, it doesn't feel it as much, and then you exercise it, it's probably not the best thing. I gotcha. So, but while this is new research and there is up to 9% uh, decrease in muscle strength is mm -hmm. what they've found. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's a lot. Nine, nine and a half percent, something like that. Um, when you have only about 10% right. <laughs> strength exactly. in your muscles. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> uh, but I'm not, you know, I, I wanted to provide this because this has been in the all the runner's magazines. It's been in all the lifting magazines. It's been in all the stuff. But it's really new, this thought. This this thinking is very new, mm -hmm. and there are some studies that are showing that, yes, there actually is a difference. And so we want to pay attention to that, and we want to bring it out. Um, but that doesn't mean that we don't want you to ever stretch again, you know, right. kind of thing. So it's, again, you want to warm your muscle. You don't want to go into anything cold. So right. it's you don't want to go into your activity cold. You don't want to go into your stretching cold. And, uh, of course, that whole bouncing you know, where people do, that is never a great idea. Period. Right. Yeah. That's so bou bouncing when you stretch is not, no. a, it's, it, you'd rather Pick hold, the, hold the position, right? Well, that's the static stretch. Right. The dynamic stretch is what you're talking about when they do those uh, mm -hmm. knee raises mm -hmm. and when they're running around, and especially the sprinters, you'll see mm -hmm. them going out, doing that high right. knee raise thing right. all the time. That is truly preparing for that event. Right. So instead of doing just random stretches that, oh, you know, these are the ones that, I've seen people do, or this is what we say, and that kind of stuff. Yeah. It's uh, doing over-exaggerated uh, motions in the same, that's going to be in the same realm as the activity you're right. about to do. That use the muscles yes. that you're going to be using. Exactly. And, yeah. And then, now I also read that uh, each muscle has an opposite muscle yes. that works with it so oh absolutely you have to but if if you have one stronger than the other one that's where injury can happen so yeah. you've got to make sure that that's you're working balance. both sides mm -hmm. and, and the the thing that i read was like the hamstring and the quadriceps, quadriceps. Now the quadriceps in the front of your thigh yes. and the hamstring is on the back, back of your thigh uh -huh. and those two things have to work yeah because uh, many years ago um there was a chief in the first game on the first play, he, he pulled his hamstring or he yeah. tore it or something like right. that. And I, I said, how could somebody like that do that? It was Eddie Kennison, I think. How uh -huh. could somebody like that do that yeah. when you've been working out, you know, for four or five weeks and you're, a, you're an incredible athlete? But it's just one thing was pulling harder than the, the other, other thing in that, uh -huh. in that case. So you've got to make sure that you're doing that. And there's, there's stuff in your arms as sure. well, right? In your a back. Lot, the biggest one is, is if you think bicep on the front and, and tricep on the back. And so... Um, and usually the uh, more injuries happen on eccentric contraction, which concentric is the is the closing of the action, okay. and eccentric is the releasing of the action. So the concentric motion is the one that's coming up, mm -hmm. but that's why if you have ever worked with a trainer or anything like that, they're going to make you go down just as slow or even mm. twice as slow as you came up. Mm. And that is to and where... that's harder. <laughs> and it is harder. It's it harder, is. Yeah. And that's where more injuries happen. And because that is strengthening the balancing muscle to this. And, and this mm. one's bigger. Mm -hmm. The one on the front's bigger. Makes sense. You know, you, there's four quadriceps. That's what the quad's for in the front. And there's uh -huh. the two hamstrings yeah. in the back. So, yeah. you know... They, they have to balance. You're right. But they don't balance equally. Right. They balance in like a, depending on the muscle group in a 60-40 or a you sure. know, different one. But sure. they still have to. And they have to work together. They have to work together. They have together. to work together. Uh -huh. um, now, as, uh, with any athlete, but especially with a weekend warrior, posture uh -huh. is going to be really important if you're going to be going. I mean, a weekend warrior is certainly going to go through some sort of a stretch, you you would hope, even if it's just taking the golf club and yeah. and twisting or something like that. And that's or, or really. Or doing, doing some swings and things like that. But posture is also important in stretching. Yes. Uh, the weekend warrior, it really, stretching is going to be more important because mm -hmm. they, they are not um, probably going to be putting the same exertion on those muscles as right. your professional athlete who is prepared to do explosive bursts in a certain thing that they have done over and over and over. Right. And like, as you said, have, this is something that is not new to their muscle group, but when you pick up that, you know, softball bat for the first time in <laughs> eight months and, uh, 
we're just going to go out and get started. You want to kind of let your body know something's going to happen. Right, <laughs> you yeah. Kind of yeah. let it know. Yeah. Just, you yeah. know, that there's a little interest going on. <laughs> yeah. Kind of wake up, uh, you know, get ready. <laughs> yeah, I think that's a good idea. I know when I when I played high school baseball, that it, of course it was cold at the time we sure. started. We were inside, and the, and the coach would make us just swing the bat. Yeah. I mean, we would just that's swing the bat for five minutes or something yep. like that, and every day we'd do that. And it was uh-huh. boring as can be, but that was, you know, to get those muscles stronger and get them stretched out and all that kind of stuff, so it certainly makes well, sense. And in I still couldn't hit the curveball, <laughs> but, <laughs> but I was stronger when I when I brought the bat through the strike zone. And so. interestingly, one study does talk about with um, in the military and in high school sports, when they, they did studies of those doing calisthenics, stretching reduced injury. Right. And so that is really kind of where we had started with that, you, you know, the stretching reduces injury. Well, true. In some cases, depending on what the sport is, what's going to happen, how long have you been off, you know, all that kind of thing. So. Right. Well, we're talking with Dr. Lynn McIntosh from Kansas City Chiropractic. Her office is located at 4510 Bellevue. Phone number is 816-753-4600. And her website is kansascitychiropractic.com. Now, uh, one of the other things about stretching is, is after you've had an injury, you certainly want to start working back into things, and stretching is going to be a way that you're going to do that. I, I guess the first question is: um, Is it okay to feel a little bit of pain if you're no. not, if you're even if you're not, if you're just stretching out n- normally? Is it okay to feel a little bit of pain? Now, if you're coming back from an injury, that's a different yeah. kind of thing, and you're going to know what pain is good and what pain is, yeah. is bad. But you know, let's talk about that. Okay. Too. All right. Go ahead. Um, oh, okay. Uh, I. I didn't know if you were going out. No, or no, not. Okay. no, no, no. Um, it is a, typically there is a difference between pull and pain, and if you've done anything ever, you understand that difference. Mm-hmm. Pull is fine. I mean, that's the point. That's what you're doing. We do want to c- increase flexibility. Um, after an injury, we want it to be healed enough. Yes, you want to keep full range of motion, and so that's why we want to move it, and you want to keep it moving so that the blood flow stays in there and that the muscle fibers line up and that things start healing appropriately, but you really don't want to, you don't want to have pain after that. I mean, there's a little, like a little discomfort, a little pull is completely different from, Oh, it's really hurting. No, yeah. no, no. Yeah. Then that means we haven't healed quite enough. Right. Now, again, if you did nothing, if you just stopped, if you got hurt and you just stopped, everything's going to freeze up. And then it's going to be an excruciating, uh, it can be excruciating, the amount of pain to try and get it back to normal range of motion. That's why you just want to have nice gentle movement prior so to So that. that's where the therapy of some kind uh, as you come back from that is going to help, help move that muscle yeah. in a way that is going to help it yeah. heal faster because there's Much. blood showing up to it yeah. but also yeah okay i got gotcha. you back in the day we it was like oh bed rest you just stay down don't mm. do anything oh no now it's you know 12 hours or whatever even less for depending really you know you start it's back in. getting up and getting moving and especially the knee replacements they have a machine that just immediately they start moving that joint to right. keep to keep that flexibility shoulders are the worst um if People do not do the rehab, and they're like, oh, well, the rehab hurts. I don't want to do it. Mm-hmm. No, if you don't, that will, you'll get a frozen shoulder, and then it's much worse. And yeah, I heard so, that. So, yep. That's potentially terrible. Pain, painful. Um, absolutely horrible. Solution for that. Yeah. Absolutely, absolutely horrible. Absolutely. And of course, and we've only got a couple of minutes here, but uh, of course, Stretching during the business day is not a bad idea for those of us that just... For work, yeah. yes. For We're not about to participate in an activity. Stretch is great because we do want flexibility. We do want range of motion. We do want movement mm-hmm. into the joints. And the joints get nutrition through movement, and uh, whereas the rest of it's blood flow. And absolutely, especially in this clo- in this yeah. <laughs> this computer position that we've got things going where your head's forward and your shoulders are rounded and all that kind of stuff, it's like, oh, absolutely, you want to stretch and you want to open up your chest and you want to bring your head back. And, and your body na- naturally, I mean, you'll get up from your chair and you'll do that. Yes. Your body naturally will do that. Absolutely. Now, now I have to have a, ask you a question. I know uh, everybody looks at their phone and they, they do this. And they look <laughs> at front. Do you see a whole lot of neck injuries coming our way in the next couple of years uh, that wrist it, well we've I mean, already we all, lost we all held books like this too when we read but now it's now it's it's this yeah 
it's more down mm-hmm. than a book. A book is typically out mm-hmm. here. Um, and or the book was on the table. It's we were we're already seeing lots of thumb injuries. I yeah. mean, there's a gamer's thumb. There's a th- <laughs> that's what it's called. Uh, you know, because of the kids playing yeah. video games so much and yeah. this kind of stuff. And so, it really um, anything we do to excess and anything that we don't balance with a different activity is mm-hmm. going to have a repetitive stress injury. I ju- yeah, I just see it. that. I just go out to lunch and I just yep. see people that are doing this, and I'm thinking, oh my gosh, there's neck injuries coming our way. <laughs> the chiropractors are going to be in business for a long time, and it's gonna it's gonna be you know whatever it's called. We'll it's loss something. of the cervical curve is oh, okay. what it is. Is that what it yeah. is? And yeah, so the, curve in the, it yeah curve it's in supposed the to curve one way, and most people are straight now, and most are, tr- are actually have reversed the curve already just with computer <laughs> use and, and stuff. So, Well, uh, Dr. McIntosh, thank you so much for Absolutely. coming in. Uh, you can reach Dr. McIntosh at uh, 816-753-4600 or visit her website, KansasCityChiropractic.com. She's located at 4510 Bellevue. That's just right off the plaza. That will do it for our show today. I want to thank our our host for the show today, Will Walker and Old Shawnee Pizza. Our guest, former Royals World Series champ Greg Pryor and his wife Michelle. And Dr. Lynn McIntosh from Kansas City Chiropractic. Be sure to join me, Steve Fish, again next week at the same time for Good Sports. Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC Show. And check out some of our other shows on YouTube. Search for the Good Sports KC channel. So until next week, be sure to read all about sports, health, and exercise. In Kansas City Sports and Fitness and She KC magazines, you'll find them all over Kansas City, and they're free, so pick them up today. These days, we're all so busy, and many of us ignore our health and let stress turn into chronic pain. Dr. Lynn McIntosh of Kansas City Chiropractic can provide you with the proper care to relieve pain and stress, improve your health, and get more out of life. And right now, like Kansas City Chiropractic on Facebook and save 50% on a 30-minute massage. To make an appointment with Dr. McIntosh, call 816-753-4600. Most insurance plans are welcome. For more information on Dr. McIntosh and Kansas City Chiropractic, go online at kansascitychiropractic.com. The next time you're planning a group outing, choose yellow and choose first. Those yellow buses you see that transport your kids can also be rented for group activities like going to the big game, corporate events, church or youth group trips, special events, shuttles, and more. Choose yellow by contacting First Student Charter Bus Rental for safe, affordable, and reliable group transportation. With eight KC locations, there's a yellow office near you. Visit firstcharterbus.com or call 866-514-8747 and choose yellow and choose first. With the current trend to live a greener lifestyle, many people and businesses now recycle their electronics. At the Surplus Exchange, your e-waste will never go to a landfill or incinerator, nor will we allow e-waste to be shipped overseas. Some companies employ this tactic and end up polluting other countries with our waste. All materials are safely tracked, destroyed, or reclaimed right here in the U.S. The Surplus Exchange is Kansas City's link between industry, charity, and the environment. To find out more, visit surplusexchange.org. Bring basketball fever to your own backyard or driveway with your very own game court from Sport Court of Kansas City. Let Sport Court come and install a basketball game court at your home. Game courts can also be installed for volleyball, racket sports, soccer, tennis, or roller hockey. So sink that basket at the buzzer and have your own Final Four at home in your backyard or driveway Sport Court. For more details, call Sport Court at 913-963-7529 or visit sportcourtkc.com. The city's best 18-hole championship golf course. Stanley Farms is a truly enjoyable private club experience for golfers of all skill levels with a welcoming atmosphere where members can always get a tee time, offering both fine dining and a casual grill, plus a soon-to-be state-of-the-art fitness center. Our rustic clubhouse is an inviting place for the whole family. Going on now through the end of June, get a $500 card voucher with your membership. Whatever your handicap, prepare for a unique experience at Staley Farms. There's family fun for everyone at Danny Jackson's Incredible. Bowling, mini golf, laser tag, and more. Incredible has it all. And right now with the coupon in KC Sports and Fitness, you can buy one double play and get one free. Or buy one meal at Incredible's Breakfast Nook and get one free. Visit Incredible at 151st and Antioch. Find them online at Incredible.com or call 913-851-1700. 
For over 40 years, Old Shawnee Pizza has been serving up great pizza and Italian food in Kansas City. Call 913-631-5716 for Old Shawnee Pizza at 61st and Neiman and 913-677-1844 for their new location at 2422 South 34th Street. Two of the finest golf clubs in Kansas City are right in Overland Park. St. Andrew's Golf Club at Neiman and 135th Street and Overland Park Golf Club at 125th and Quivera. For tee times, call St. Andrew's at 913-897-3804 and OP Golf Club at 913-897-3809 or visit golfop.com. Hey ladies, we now have a free sports health and exercise magazine we can call our own. It's She KC. Every month, She KC shares stories that will inspire us, entertain, and educate us, and give us ideas to help make life easier. I went to SheKC.com to find out where I could get my free copy of the publication. I also like She KC on Facebook and She underscore KC on Twitter. And now I'm part of the She KC community. Are you?